Okay, our next question is question number 6. Multiply and express as a mixed fraction and there are A, B, C, D, E, F. 6 question under this question number 6. So, we will solve one by one first 6A. 6A says, okay, 3 into 5 and 1 by 5. This we can write 3 into 5, 5 are 25, 1, 26 by 5. Now again, 26 by 5 is a fraction number, 3 is a whole number. So, how we are multiplying? We will keep the denominator same and this will be 3 into 26. Okay, 6, 3 is 18, carry 1. Okay, it is 78 by 5. Now, 78 by 5 is to be changed to a mixed number because this is not a proper fraction. This is a improper fraction. So, what we will do? We will divide here. 78 by 5. Okay, 5 1 is 5, 2, then 5 5 is 25. Okay, 3, 3 by 5. So, what is the answer? Answer is 15 and 3 by 5 and this is the only answer for question number. Okay, for not having confusion, I am changing, I am erasing this one. So, our answers are like that. So, we have completed 6a. Now, we will see 6b. 6b says 5 multiply by 6 and 3 by 4. That can be written as 5 multiply by. Now, this mixed number is to be broken into an improper fraction. So, 6 4 are 24, 24 and 3, 27 by 4. 27 by 4. Again, a fraction number is to be multiplied by a whole number. So, numerator will be having 5 multiplied by 27 and denominator will be same. Okay. 35, 3 and 5 to the 10, 3, 13. So, finally, we have got 135 by 4. Now, this is to be changed to a mixed number. For that again, we have to divide 135 divided by 4, 4, 3 ja, 12, 1, 4, 3 ja, 12, it is 3. So, 3 by 4. So, our answer is 33, 3 by 4. This is the answer. We should not have confusion for that one. Again, I am rubbing this portion of the board. So, we are not having any confusion. So, like that we have completed 6b. Next is 6c. 6c says 7 multiply by 2 and 1 by 4. That will be written as 7 multiply by this mixed fraction is to be broken to change to improper fraction. So, 4 to the 8 and 1, 9, 9 by 4. This is again a fraction number to be multiplied by whole number. So, what we have to do? Numerator we have to multiply, denominator will be same. So, it will be 4 and the numerator will be. So, that will be giving you 63 by 4. Okay, so this is to be converted to again a mixed number. So, that we will give division here 63 divided by 4, 4 1 4, 2, okay. So, our answer is 15 and 3 by 4. 
there should not be confusion. So, I am removing this portion of the writing. So, our answer is 15 and 3 by 4. Okay. So, we have completed 6C. Now, we will go for solving 6D. 6D says 4 multiplied by 6 and 1 by 3. That will be 4 multiplied by 6, 3 is 18, 1, 19 by 3. Okay. Again, same whole number is multiplying a fractional number. So, numerator will only get multiplied by whole number. Denominator will be unchanged. So, denominator will be 3 and it will be 6, 3, 7 by 3. So, again this is to be, so how much we have got? 76 by 3. This is to be changed to again mixed number. So, mixed number we have to divide 6 to ja, 3 to ja, 6, 6 5 ja, 15, 1 by 3 equal to 25 and 1 by 3. And for to have less confusion, I will delete this one. So, this is the only answer for question number 6D. So, D we have completed. Now, we will solve question number 6E. 6E says 3 and 1 by 4 multiply by 6. So, this fraction number is to be changed to a improper fraction and that is 4, 3, 12 and 13 by 4 multiply by 6. So, denominator will be unchanged, numerator will be multiplied by 6. So, 13 multiplied by 6. So, it is 18, 1 and 6, 1, 7. It is 78 by 4. 70 by 8 by 4 is a improper fraction. So, this is to be changed to a mixed fraction. So, that we will divide and that we will divide. That is equal to 19 and 2 by 4. So, to avoid the confusion, I will okay remove this portion. So, now you see 19 and 2 by 4, the 2 and 4 is having a common factor 2. That also I will remove. That is equal to 19 and 2 into 1 by 2 into 2. So, 2, 2 getting cancelled and finally, we are getting 19 and 1 by 2 and this is the answer for our question number 6E. Now, we will go for 6F. 6F says 3 and 2 by 5. 2 by 5 multiply by 8. So, this fraction 3 and 2 by 5 is that is a mixed fraction that is to be converted to improper fraction. So, 5 3 is a 15, 16 17 by 5. Again, a fraction is to be multiplied by a whole number. So, only numerator will be multiplied, denominator will be same. So, 17 multiplied by 8. 56, 5 and 36, 136 by 5. Again, 136 by 5 is an improper fraction that is to be converted to mixed fraction as per the instruction of the question. So, we will convert to mixed fraction by 5 to the 10, 3, 27 and 1 by 5 
okay and to avoid confusion i am removing this portion of the okay this is the only answer for question number 6f and like that we have completed all the six questions which are given under main question question number 6 now we'll move to next question that is question number 7 that says find and under question number 7 there are two question a and b under a again there are two question that is 1 and 2 and under b also there are two question 1 and 2 so we will solve all these four questions one by one first we will say take one Seven A one says half of half of two and three by four. So that can be written as half multiply by two and three by four. That can be written as now here this two and three by four is a mixed fraction that is to be changed to improper fraction. So what we will do? One by two will be one by two only. Multiply by four to the eight. Eight plus three equal to eleven. Eleven by four. Okay. So this numerator will be multiplied by numerator, and denominator will be multiplied by denominator. So it will be one multiplied by eleven, and two multiplied by four. So that will give you answer. Eleven by eight. Now eleven by eight is again a improper fraction number. So we have to change to the mixed fraction number. So eight one ja eight. Okay, there are three remainder. So three will be the numerator and it will be the denominator. So what is the answer? One and three by eight. Is answer for seven one seven a one. Now we'll see next question seven a two. Seven a two says one by two of of four and two by nine. This can be written as one by two of will be multi. Change to multiplied, and this fraction number, that is mixed fraction number, is to be converted to improper fraction. So nine four yeah thirty six, thirty six thirty seven thirty eight, thirty eight by nine. Now two fraction are to be multiplied. So numerator will be multiplying the numerator. And denominator will be multiplying the denominator, and that will be written like this: one into thirty-eight, two into nine. So you will get thirty-eight by eighteen. Okay. So thirty-eight by eighteen is a improper fraction number that is to be converted to a mixed number. So we will divide thirty-eight divided by eighteen. Two ja thirty-six two. So our answer will be answer will be two and two by eighteen. Now two by eighteen, two by eighteen is having a common factor two. So that we will remove. So that we can write equal to two and two into one by two into nine. So two two getting cancel, it will be two and one by nine. And this is the only answer for our question number seven a two. Now we will change over to seven b one. Seven b one says. Five by eight of five by eight of that is three and five by six. Three and five by six. That will be changed to 
5 by 8 of will be changed with multiplication and this mixed number should be changed to improper fraction 6 3 is 18 18 and 5 23 by 6 so 23 by 6 now we have to multiply the two fraction numbers so numerator should multiply the numerator and denominator should multiply the denominator. So, what we will get 5 into 23 by 8 into 6. If we multiply 5 3 is 15, carry 1, 5 2 is 10 and 1, 115. Okay. And 48, 4 and 4. So, what we have got? We have got 1 on 5 by 48. Now, this 1 on 5 by 48 is a improper fraction number that is to be changed to mixed fraction number. So, that also we will change by dividing 1 on 5 by 48. Okay. We are getting equal to 2 and 19 by 48. Okay, to remove, to have less confusion, I will remove this one. So, as 19 is a prime number, so our answer will be 2 and 19 by 48 because there is no common in between 19 and 48. So, this is only the answer of our question number 7B1. Now we will solve 7b2. 7b2 says why 5 by 8 of, of that is 9 and 2 by 3. 9 and 2 by 3. That can be written as 5 by 8. 5 by 8 and of will be replaced by multiplication. Multiplication. And this 9 and 2 by 3 should be changed to improper fraction. So, 9 3 is 27, 27, 28, 29 by 3, 29 by 3. So, now 2 mix, 2 fraction number are to be multiplied. So, numerator will multiply the numerator and denominator will multiply the denominator. So, what is the answer we are getting? We will get 5 into 29 upon 8 into 3. Okay. If you do multiplication 9, 45, 4. Okay. It is coming 145 and it is coming 24. So, our answer is 145 by 24. But this answer is a improper fraction number. This is to be changed to mixed fraction number. So, that also we will change. We can divide 145 by 24. Okay. So, we will give 6 times. Uh, 24, 2, 40. So, if we do 1 by 24, our answer will be 6 and 1 by 24 and this is the only answer. To remove confusion, I will remove this portion of the answer. Okay. So, like that we have seen that we have solved all the four questions that is 7A1, 7A2. 7b1 and 7b2 of question number 7. Now we will solve next question that is question number 8. 8 question says Vidya and Pratap went for a picnic. 
their mother gave them a water bottle that contained 5 liters of water. Vidya consumed 2 by 5 of the water. Pratap consumed the remaining water. So, now one question, how much water did Vidya drink? And second question is, what fraction of the total quantity of water did Pratap drink? So, we will do one by one. Okay, that is 8, 1. Okay, water, water consumed by Vidya. equal to 2 by 5 of 5 liter. That is equal to 2 by 5 multiply by 5. So, now see a fraction number is to be multiplied by a whole number. So, that will be okay 10 that is 2 into 5 by 5 that is 10 by 5 and that is 2 liter. So, how much Vidya consumed? Vidya consumed 2 liters of water out of 5 liter. Now, we have to go to 8.2. Now, second part of the question, what fraction of total quantity of water did Pratap ding? So, First, we will find out what is the quantity Pratap consumed. The quantity of water, quantity of water, water consumed by Pratap equal to 5 minus 2 liters. Where from 2? Two? 2 was consumed by that is Vidya. So, what was left? So, it was left 3 liters that is 3 liters. And what was the total? So, fraction, fraction equal to quantity consumed by Pratap and that is divided by total quantity, total quantity of water. So, that will be how much Pratap consumed? 3 and what was the total? Total was 5. So, 3 by 5 of the given water was consumed by Pratap and this is the fraction Pratap has consumed and like that we have completed all the 8 questions given in exercise 2.2, .2. given in exercise 2.2 .2. and now we will start 2.3 and before 2.3 we will see what are the new things we need to learn and what are the tries given in the textbook. That also we will solve. Then only we will start 2.3. Here we will end this video. Further discussion will be in our next video.